Hey Fleet Ready fam, welcome to Fleet Ready Gaming. My name is Sabad and welcome to the channel. Today we have a new news alert going over a special announcement CIG made today on uh, March 29th. Uh, today is Wednesday, uh, covering some changes that are happening with the PTU cycle as well as a going forward change for new releases as well to help address future issues. So let's go ahead and check that out. Still having that audio error. That's a weird one. Uh, may have noticed I'm not wearing my headphones today. Thought I would change it up a little bit. But let's go ahead and cover the news. Uh, so hello, everyone. We would like to share an update regarding our plans for the up upcoming 318 patch releases. Following thorough discussions with our publishing and development teams, we have made the decision to implement a fundamental change to our testing process with the objective of shortening the delivery time to live. In order to increase our efficiency and remain on schedule for Alpha 319, we will be conducting simultaneous release management of both the 3.18.1 and 3.18.2 patches. We have locked 3.18.1 for external testing and our development team is now hammering away at it with, the set, with a set of uh, updated load testing tools. While load testing has always been a part of our process, we are making changes to incorporate this new method of locking and doing final load testing internally for all future releases. We are eager to, uh, to start testing uh, 3.18.2 on the PTU with all of you, potentially as early as tomorrow, being Thursday, by testing 3.18.2 and locking 3.18.1 in this way, we believe we can save time to help us reach our upcoming major milestones. This will also make space for us to create the 319 branch as soon as possible so we can start the process of preparing to go to PTU soon after, after the release of 318.2. It was important that we communicate this to you early so that there is no confusion when 318.2 rolls out for testing, despite 318.1 not having hit the live servers yet. We're excited about this new approach and hope it will bring significant improvements to how we roll out our regular content. As always, we sincerely appreciate your ongoing support and look forward to seeing you in the verse. Now, this is interesting. Let's go ahead and switch back to the host view. This is interesting, you know. Um, essentially, what this is saying uh, is we're going to be having two open PTU branches uh, out at the same time. I'm curious if, you know, the 318.2 will be going out to Eva Cardi first. So, you know, essentially 318.1 will be open to all backers to continue hammering away issues while they are also doing these internal load test uh, tests that they're doing to make sure everything is working properly. But, you know, who knows, maybe 318.2 will also be open PTU as well. That will be interesting to see with tomorrow's... Uh, if any new news on that comes out. Um, you know, we didn't get an update today uh, with 318.1 on the PTU. I assume, well, actually, I don't have to assume it was mentioned that it's because they're doing these internal testings right now. And, you know, hopefully we'll see an update of that tomorrow. Um, but, yeah, you know, if uh, if there are two PTUs open tomorrow, which one would you prefer to play? Write down in the comment section below. I'd love to hear, you know, are you going to continue working with the one that will be releasing out to live? Uh, or will you check out the newest uh, things that will be going into 318.2, which I'm curious, you know, what exactly else would be in there that would require, you know, we... You know, Fleet Week is still quite some time away. We still have several months for that, and that would most likely be in the 319 branch. Um, so I'm curious what exactly the point two patch is going to actually be bringing. Um, 
interesting. Let me know what you guys think. Um, with that being said, we're going to end the video here. Um, if you haven't already, um, you know, like the video. It helps us out a lot. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. It really, really helps us out. We're looking to grow. Currently sitting at 81 members. I, like I said, our ticker is always a day off. Um, sitting at 81 members looking to grow to 100. Once we hit that 100 mark, we're going to be having another giveaway contest with our LTI vessel already secured to give away more info on that once we get closer to our subscriber goal. But with that being said, that's going to end the video here. I hope you guys have a wonderful evening and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.